I traded as BHV and it's down today 9%. The first uh, move was down, then it bounced up. Now this uh, pullback up that you're seeing here is exactly what I'm looking for. I'm looking for a failure. It's down 9%, it's supposed to come down. I'm about to short it right at this reversal sign. Now I'm short 4,000 shares. It's supposed to be coming down now. And again, you expect it from a stock that is gapping down more than 9%, actually more than 3%. This one's down 10%. And here's Tesla again. I made a lot of money with Tesla in the past week and with 100% success rate so far. Look at this reversal point right here. Well, Tesla initially moved up, then came down. Now it's trying to make its way up. If it's going to move over 8 or 5, I'm going to take the risk again. And I'm taking big, big risk with Tesla because I'm feeling very confident with these trades. Here we go, over 8 or 5 now. Just slightly moved higher, buying now. Actually got it at 8 or 4.50. Let's hope Tesla's gonna move over the highs. Well, BHVN is approaching my stop loss, which is over 47. That the, oh, here we go. About to stop it, about to stop it. 47, whole number, come down, come down. Don't continue, it's up. Ooh, moving up. Okay, moved out. My first trade today is a losing trade. Unpleasant. Back to Tesla, which uh, so far looks good. And we're getting close to the highs. We're at the highs. 808.50 and we're over the highs. Cool. Look at the numbers here. 9 grand, 10 grand, 11 grand. And we're going $13,000. Getting ready for my partial. Getting ready. $16,000, $17,000. Down a bit. About to take my partial taking now. That was a beautiful trade in Tesla. I have 100% success rate so far with Tesla. It was a lovely trade. Look at it again. I mean, it's uptrending. People are joining it. The fun thing about Tesla is that the, the, the greed factor works so great. I mean, it just moved up a bit and so many people joined. Well, so did I. Well, Roku is very, very tempting. In fact, I'm going to do something I don't usually do. I'm going to short this move up. It's just unsustainable. I'm going to take a risk here and short it. Shorting now, 4,000 shares in Roku. I'm hoping it's going to come down. And, you know, I'm, I'm not planning a long trade here, just a scalp. I have a risk here of approximately 60 cents. If it's going to move over the highs, 129 I'll be out and it's getting there and it's getting there. So I was looking for a 60 cent pullback and it seems like I can't even get that. Here comes the whole number, it's over the whole number. Oh shoot, sure. shouldn't have done that. Shouldn't have done that. I'm down like four grand. I should have known better. I don't usually do this kind of trade. It was very, very tempting. In fact, it takes me back so many years where I was doing so many stupid things like this one. Well, that was a stupid thing to do. You don't short a stock that is moving up that much. Definitely not a good idea. Just those four grand. NVIDIA looks fantastically well. Look at this beautiful bull flag formation. It's up 1.5%. I'm about to go long. Over 255.40 I'll go long. Look at the seller side right here. I'm long. Just moved up over the highs, great. It's looking good. In order to really understand NVIDIA, you need to take a look at the daily. It's not just a beautiful intraday, it's also the daily. Now let's take a look at the daily here. Here's the daily. So you see long consolidation at the highs, moving higher. Well, you can see the way that it moved higher earlier, this uh, red candle here where it failed. But, you know, when, when you have such a perfect looking daily, it's very, very rare that you're going to lose money. So a combination of a perfectly good looking daily like this with the intraday, I mean, it's a combination. You have to add the intraday to the daily. In fact, it means that a lot of people are going to join you because intraday traders were going to are going to take that. But also core traders, long term investors are going to take it because of the daily. Um, just closed my Tesla trade because I think it's kind of failing. You know, the fact that Tesla is up 8%, that 
doesn't mean it's going to continue moving higher. You know, Tesla's been up on the daily, dramatically up. And when the stock is up that much, there's a lot of profit taking. So I'm looking for the second trade in Tesla, but this one got to be on the short side. And it is approaching and I'm about to show 2000 shares. Here comes 807 now. I'm short 2000 shares in Tesla. Now again, uh, it's up that much, so much. Just started at $250 a few weeks ago that you just can't expect people to keep riding Tesla without taking some profits. It's just almost impossible. So when it moved up today, I enjoyed taking it for a ride. And here we go now. We go down as expected because, again, there's a lot of profit taking and greed does not work as good as fear. Fear is much stronger than greed. And I'm up four grand right now. Six grand, eight grand. Come on, come on, Tesla. Come to Papa. Nine, <laughs> ten. Getting ready for my partial here. 11, $16,000. My second trade in Tesla. Getting ready for a partial. $17,000. Any sign of a pullback? $18,000 took. Wow. Second beautiful trade in Tesla. It's absolutely crazy. It's amazing. I, I can't remember having such a fun time with Tesla ever. In fact, I don't remember having such a fun time with any stock I've been trading. I'm taking very high risks but so far having a 100% success rate and again profit taking people can't hold on to these prices are coming when it comes down people are joining and then it goes down again exactly like they went long earlier nvidia is just beautiful it um, moved to the highs i'm a bit concerned of a pullback so i'll be taking my partial right here right here somewhere it's not much now I was expecting more than that. I was expecting more. It could and probably going to do a bit more. But you know what? I'm having such a good day now with Tesla. I'd rather put this one behind me. LYFT is very interesting. The stock is up 5%. Now the highs is 52.52. There's a big seller at 50. You can see the sellers right here at uh, the level 2. Look at the big seller here. 24,000 shares. It's going to go through. It's going to go. Here we go. I'm long. Just went long. I don't see the seller anymore. It looks fine. LYFT just reached my target, which was over 52.90. I was risking 40 cents, looking for 40 cents. Took my partial. Well, tell you what. Um, like to have another winner here. It just came up to the whole number. I don't trust it to continue. Tesla. I'm thinking about adding. I was uh, really thinking earlier, I'm not going to have another trade in Tesla, push my luck, still, still have 100% success rate in Tesla. But look at this beautiful breakdown formation here. So what I'm going to do is just take 600 shares short, very small size. Once it breaks down under this support now. Okay, just came down under this support. And I'm hoping I'm going to see a new low in Tesla because it looks fine, but it is very, very small size. Tesla worked out fine. As you can see here, it crashed down earlier, but I did not manage to make to take my partial there. In fact, I made a mistake, but it's coming down once more again. It's trending. There we are. There we are. Cool. Five grand in Tesla. Getting ready to cover my 600 shares. Left just 600 shares earlier. I made a mistake earlier, but... Um, and I missed my target point, but now it's coming back down again. So I'm getting there. I'm out. Just close that trade. Again, Tesla is trending lower. The fun part is over. The fun part was just here at the beginning, but then it just went sideways, slowly coming down. That was a beautiful second trade, third trade in Tesla. Look at the numbers here. $35,000 in Tesla. This is crazy. And the rest just small winners, small losers, up over $30,000 today. I'm making more money the past week than I made in six months. Thank you for watching our video. Before you go, we invite you to join the TradeNet trading room for a free 14-day trial. 
Traded has educated more than 30,000 professional traders worldwide since 2004, and its trading room is one of the world's leading trading communities. Click here to start your free trial. If you like this video, please subscribe to our YouTube channel where you can view many more stock trading videos. Questions or comments, please submit them below.